Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett. It's Wednesday, which means it's brand new comic book day. Comics are hitting shelves all across the world. Digitally, physically, it's like the best day of the week. Now, in my hands is something that I picked up at San Diego Comic-Con because I loved it so much. I mean, this is probably like my, at least my second copy, maybe my third physical copy, just because it's that freaking awesome. This is Return of the Dapper Men, a new edition, kind of like the complete ultimate edition, uh, being published by Top Shelf now and IDW Publishing by Jim McCann and Janet K. Lee. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to read the description because that kind of will do it uh, best to describe it. So it's, Welcome to the world of Anara, the land where time has no meaning, robots work and children play, but the play is no fun and the work is no use. A curious boy named Aiden and his robot friend Zoe know that something's missing, but they can't imagine what it might be until... 314 identical men in green bowler hats fall from the sky. At last, our heroes have a chance to discover what happened to their world, what might start the clocks back up again, and what tomorrow really means. This uh, story is a magical kid's story. Like, I can't, I can't emphasize it enough. Um, when, I, when this first came out was, uh, let me see, the back in the day, uh, 2010. So it's been seven years since that this was released. It was an award-winning book, like won tons of awards, tons of praise, absolutely deserved. I expect this one's going to get nominated for like best reprint of the year. Um, and the story is just, it's magical. It's the best way of describing it. It's absolutely magical. I felt like I was a kid taken back to uh, worlds that I love. And, and I mean, yeah, I mean, it's, it's a, I can't, you know, I can't praise this enough, basically. Um, the story, I don't want to go too much into it because that's, I think, part of the fun of this is discovering this world, and uh, it's a different one. It's it's really interesting, kind of has this very Alice in Wonderland vibe to it, uh, and, it's, and little Peter Pan with kids who never grow up. And basically the question is, you know, what is this world when there is no tomorrow? And then the question is, uh, really, what is this world when tomorrow finally comes? And uh, there's two more volumes coming out. Uh, the next volume will be out in 2018, and I can't freaking wait for this. Um, beautiful, magical, amazing. This is a book that is a must-get if you are a serious comic fan, and this is a book that is much uh, a must-share if you are a serious comic fan. Like when when parents are saying, "Hey, well, you know, what should I get for kids to read?" Return of the Dapper Men is like right up there on my list. When people say, you know, what is a beautiful comic to read and look at, and that's magical and wonderful, Return of the Dapper Men is right up there on my list. Um, uh, fantastic read, fantastic look at. To just to say it is so amazing. Like I actually went out and bought uh, two original pieces of artwork from this book because I loved it so much. Uh, you know, that should right there tell you uh, how fantastic it is. Now, it's not just Jim McCann's writing that is uh, amazing about it. But, you know, Janet K. Lee's art is up there as well. So I want to show this because I don't think you're going to get an idea as to how amazing this really is um, until we kind of get to the end and describe what some of this is. I mean, we can check out some of this art here is absolutely amazing. Um, what the art actually is is basically wood blocks that are uh, painted on the background and then cut up a little bit. Uh, like the drawings are done and then the background's cut up and that's kind of layered on top of the wood and little pieces are put out there um, and then that's colored like there's that's part of the thing that I love about this book like I read it and love the story love the art and then I got to the back matter of it and it described uh, Janet's process and my jaw dropped it takes it from like this amazing piece of art to the next level where you're like, this is an instant classic. I know a lot of people overuse that. This is an instant classic. Like This is absolutely an instant classic. Uh, I think one of the best graphic novels in the last decade, easily. Um, can't recommend this enough. I just absolutely love it. I can't wait for the next volume. I'm so happy that this enhanced edition is there. There's all sorts of extras in it. Um, it has all the supplemental features plus the story. There's new art, new commentary. 32 extra pages of bonus content. So even if you have the previous volume, you're probably going to get this one because it's got even more stuff that you wouldn't have seen otherwise. Uh, your shops should have this. Uh, good shops will have this. Go absolutely get this. This is a must buy. Uh, so as I said, it's from Top Shelf, IDW Publishing. Retails for $34.99. Um, I bought this at San Diego Comic-Con. There was very few things I absolutely needed to get. This is one of the things I needed to get. Uh, as I said, I already have copies of this. I still needed to get this. Uh, absolutely love it. 
loved it as much as when I first read it and will read it again and again and again and I actually look forward to the day that you know maybe I have a kid and I can share this with them because I think it's just that amazing. This is going to be the fairy tale that I will pass on to my next generation. Um, if you want to get this you should go to your local comic book shop, go support them. Uh, first and foremost there's going to be a link underneath this video you can put it in your zip code and find a shop near you if you don't have a shop near you uh, we've got links beneath this video there will be affiliate links so we do get a small percentage of that but by doing that you help support our site and that's much appreciated um, but no matter thank you for watching as always until next time keep reading those comics and enjoying those magical stories and keep it geeky Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.